Hey guys, this is Damon from thegalaxytab.com and today we're doing a an unboxing of the uh, Samsung Galaxy Tab vehicle mount aka car dock. Let's just get to it. You'll know what's in you'll know what it comes with when you unbox it, so alright, so we have a couple packages here that came with it. So let's start with this one here. So this is uh, the actual back piece. This is what the looks like what the Galaxy Tab clips on to. So you can see, it has the uh, camera hole there and the charging dock. I think this comes with a charger. So let's just make sure. I guess I'd be mounting it like this on my car and get a user manual but nobody really cares about that right let's see what else is in the second package here yeah a couple few things in here actually alright let's take off alright and this looks like the hinge the one with the uh... or the suction cup I'm sorry the suction cup with a little locking mechanism here and this looks like uh, some, so you can adjust the angle. Oh, it's pretty cool. Tighten it, and this won't. I for me, this uh, I won't be mounting it on my windshield. I'll actually be mounting it on it on the dash, and uh, hopefully at the end of the video, I'll be able to show you what it looks like mounted on my car, just so you get the idea. Here looks like. Okay, the charging cable. And the end of it is a USB, which is pretty nice. It's to charge it and use it at the same time. Another thing we got here is the actual charging uh, thing that goes into the cigarette lighter. And you can see that it has a nice glossy finish, just like how the um, charger does so it's ke kind of keeping the same uh, theme which is just looks nice but as long as it functions that's more important as you know obviously the USB port or cable goes into there this connects to the back I did see a hole in here there it is so if I un let's just take this plastic off As you can see, the little hole up there in the right upper corner just plugs in right to there. And then this goes to the cigarette lighter. So let's see what now I need to remove this piece. Well, it does give you kind of instructions on how to place it. So, I don't know if this goes down. Oh, this goes down. Interesting. Okay, great. So, let's get the Galaxy Tab in here. Show you how it will go. Alright, so the first thing, probably unplug this. So, it's nice. So, this pulls down. Sorry about that. Okay, so this pulls down. Take your Galaxy Tab and you just slide it in. Now let's see. I don't want to scratch it. That's the only problem with this thing. So, um, but it's rubberized. Actually, it looks like it's rubberized uh, tips. So the plastic is very um, feels like rubber almost. So I don't think I should worry about scratching it. So it goes in here and we just pop it in. And then the 30 pin connector kind of lines up, push it in. Oh, there, I think it detects it in car mode. Let's see, in car mode? Yes, we are in car mode already. And let's see how. I don't even know if car mode will come up. Guess not. Hmm, maybe I need to be connected. But so far, I mean, this is a very good fit. I mean, it it feels solid in there it doesn't feel like it's going to fall out this thing it's it's in there pretty good 
can't just pop out whenever you want you just have to put a little force and it pops out um, so let's finish it up by connecting as you can see it comes with little um, like notches and you just line it up onto the back here and let's take a look I think it's like this and move up there you go it definitely definitely feels sturdy it doesn't feel cheap like the ones you'd find on eBay for like 10 bucks or 17 bucks this retails for about $69.99 you can find it online for as cheap as $44 minus shipping um, so I b b before even putting it in my car I'm already very very impressed so you have full swivel uh, support so in whatever viewing angle you want so let's just tighten it up there give you an idea of how it will look so if I wanna put it in the landscape just turn it or undo this thing turn it lock it in place and again it feels very sturdy very very sturdy and of course you got the suction cup here so let's try this out now that then and my glasses I have a glass desk um, but this this is this is very good quality you can tell that this is just this is not going anywhere so and I did forget one thing actually another thing that it comes with is this disc which has a adhesive on the back so you just pull the adhesive off stick it in a place and then you should be able to um, suction it right on there and like you can just see that this is some good stuff so so there you have it this is again the Samsung Galaxy Tab Cardock um, initial impressions it is very good quality um, I love the, uh, the the fact that I can just swivel just by taking this and I can put it in whatever angle I want that I can actually charge it and it comes with a charger so I don't have to go out and buy anything additional uh, the fact that the suction is just I mean you can tell like I mentioned uh, this is not going to be going anywhere uh, let's see here the fact that the card cardock mode is not working right now this it could be for the fact that I'm using uh, that the the that the tab is using a European uh, firmware though it should work I maybe I'll test it out when I get into the car the only concern really are maybe these corners here um, when you have to force it in I think the reason why it's not going in as smooth as uh, as it would probably be is because I'm actually you having I actually have the invisible shield on the back of my tab uh, to pre to prevent uh, scratching and the the invisible shield has like a, a tackiness to it so it didn't maybe that's perhaps why it didn't slide in perfectly or maybe I need to force it a little in uh, just because of the um of the invisible shield but overall though I think this is a great buy I think for the money I don't think you can find anything better right now uh certainly the cons are very minimal and with the amount of things that you get I mean the suction cup and the charger you're paying for basically for forty four dollars which was which is what I paid for to get it off of a mobile city dot com I mean you the this thing alone is probably like twenty to thirty dollars depending on where you find a retail right so the fact that you got them both for forty four dollars or fifty dollars with shipping that's a great deal so I will get this in my car to show you how it looks but uh, you guys 
I really recommend that you get the car dock and get the official one. Don't get the, the cheapo things from eBay. Go ahead and spend a little money. I mean, you paid $600 for this device. You want to make sure that it's secured in the car. So I certainly recommend this. And uh, let, I'll post up some footage uh, from the dock attached onto the car. Thanks for, thanks for watching, guys. This is Ayman again from thegalaxytab.com. Visit us on the forums at thegalaxytabforum.com. We'll be able to help you out if you guys have any questions. Take care and happy holidays.